The great guardian god gave us the power, immortality. It is granted to a chosen few. It gives strength, shows the way. But with power comes responsibility. Aelion is a precious gift that must be protected from enemies. The great god disappeared, and hordes of invaders from other worlds came to take our home and our freedom. We won't let them. The people of Aelion believe in their heroes, and we will fight to the death. Rising again and again, we will turn the invaders' technologies and magic against them. And the hour will arrive when one of the immortals will become powerful enough to lead the entire planet, crush our enemies, and bring peace to Aerion. Listen up. We're heading for Ionor. Our mission is to clear the town of enemies and evacuate the civilians. Keep your eyes open and be careful. We're not immortal. Questions? All right then.
This is Eeanor. We received a distress call. The town is being attacked by birds. The town's residents are in hiding. We need to find and evacuate them. Come out. Come out! It's safe now! Thank the gods! You got them all! Thank you. Thank you! You're our saviors. We're saved. Thank you. Thank you so much. We thought it was the end of us. Come on! Come on! You won't take me alive! Rise, immortal. It is not the end. It is just the beginning.
I can't believe it. Birds thought you were dead. Couldn't they smell you? And you don't have a scratch on you. You must be immortal. You were born under a lucky star. Come on, it's my duty to bring you to Alienar now. Welcome to Elinar. I take it you had a pleasant trip. I am Harida. I will help you settle into your new life. You are among the Chosen. Eli, the great guardian god, managed to share part of his life essence with us before his departure into realms unknown. This power will pass on to Aelion's most worthy daughters and sons for as long as our bloodlines endure. Immortality is bestowed on you to protect our world. Death will be the one to take Eli's place. Remember, to use your new powers wisely and with kindness. But to do that, you must first learn to control them. I know someone who can help you with that. You should talk to Flavius. He is no ordinary god. His vocation is science, but don't let that discourage you. He is a miracle worker in his own way. He is waiting for you. Now go! Every time I hear there's another immortal, I wonder why it isn't me. I wish I could visit the training hall. It would be nice to feel like an immortal, even if it's just for a few minutes. That might be a good business opportunity, by the way. A rookie! Hello. Liking immortality? Not getting to your head? Oh, my manners. I'm Flavius. I'm trying to advance science here while others are waving their swords. I'm serious. Aside from me, no one's even trying to understand how things work in this world. Oh, right. This is my holographic form. No time to flit about. And there's so many immortals nowadays. Just so much to do. Right, back to business. Well, what are we waiting for? That transport capsule? You're getting in. I'll join you in the training hall. First you'll need to pick a class. I'll show you how. Pick an available class, and you'll learn its basic abilities. How about that for a miracle of science? Of course. You can always change your class, at any time. In a tricky situation, you have the Argus system to offer you advice. And of course I invented it.
The Light Binder attacks from a distance, inflicts less damage than the Cryomancer, but has a... The Cryomancer can cause significant damage from a distance. The Paladin is a melee fighter, average... The Paladin is a melee fighter. Remember, you're a paladin. Use your combo attacks. What you see now is a pack. These enemies are weak on their own, but a group of them can be extremely dangerous. Eliminate them using an area of effect ability. that are strong, but few in number, should be killed one by one. These abilities that inflict significant damage to a single target. You can avoid damage. Take a closer look at the enemy. Some attacks take time to execute. You can evade them. Did you like it? I don't normally hand out the divine form. It's not even in this training course, but that was an emergency. Someday, you'll be able to use it without my assistance. In the real world, and not just a virtual space. Oh, it's nothing. 
do your best, and the desired results will follow suit. There are many troubles on Aelion, and the most crucial one is invasions. Go fight. Go save lives. Go make friends and gain more followers, and you will eventually become strong enough to take the next step and become a junior god. I am beginning to sound like Harita. That's it for now. You can return to the Divine Observatory or wherever you need to go. You can stay if you like, but I can't promise any more fun.